Hello YouTube and welcome to something very very different, uh, never on my channel before, but a card unboxing. You'll see here a box of the old score Dragon Ball Z collectible card game. Um, this is particularly the World Games Saga. Um, I was, oops, sorry, I've never done this before. Um, World Games Saga, you can see the sealed box here. 36 packs per box. Um, very excited. I have loved this game in the past, and I found this box. It was actually very inexpensive. They're typically about 150 or more online. Sorry, we have a little glare there. Typically about 150 more online, or yeah, like I said, or more. And uh, this I got for $54, 36 packs. So very good deal. Um, I have only a few of the rare cards in this set, and I have none of the ultra rares, and I would like any of them, obviously. Um, Dragon Ball Z, the score game, there are four ultra rares per set. Um, there's a Pycon level 5, which would be my favorite. Then there's an uh, energy attack called Goku's Blinding Strike, I think, um, which is also fantastic and would be great for me. Um, there's a Goku level 5, which would be cool, and not that I have Goku personalities. Um, and then there is an evil presence drill, which is not the greatest, but I've looked into it and I'm like, I could, I could do that. But I'm also looking forward to like some masteries, I don't have many of those from this set, um, and a lot of personalities, and just some other cool cards. So, without further ado, we're going to break into this. Alright, so here we go. Let's see if I can't get this open. I have not opened up any packs of the score of Dragon Ball Z in uh, years. Okay, let's see. Box is a little rough, up, but everything is still intact. We have so many packs. So we'll just start, get that half out of the way, and we'll start with these. So let me know down below, Have did you ever collect these cards? Did you play the game? Um, I know my cousin, ugh, wow, I didn't realize how hard these were to do. Uh, my cousin and I, we played the game and collected the cards quite a bit. Um, uh, it was pretty popular, I think. So we have, let's see, uh, so the middle of nowhere. Orange Knockout. Ugh, sorry, I'll try to, I'll figure this out. Orange Knockout. Blue Fire Kick. Black Power Hit. Orange Gut Wrench. Face Off. Preview card from the Bobbity Saga. Ah. Sure. Oh, there's our rare for this pack. Pycon Level 4. And a foil, Orange Videl's Jump Kick. And then Red Energy Focus. Same Discharge, Orange Right Cross. Um, I'm going to be going pretty quick through these because I do have <laughs> 36 packs to do, and I have a lot of these cards. Um, for example, the Pycon Level 4. I do have that already. Pycon is a personality that I enjoy. I always, I always collected a lot of the um, Namekian cards. They were my my favorite, so. Alright, Red King Trunks, Nothing Throw, Black Power Hit, Orange Knockout, Blue Right Power Strike, Blue Sneak Attack, Namekian Halting Stance, good Namekian card, Capsule Corp, um, which is rare, yeah. Blue Videl Knee Bash. Namekian Double Blast, Black Diving Elbow Strike, and Blue Back Kick. Okay. Um, yeah, so I was a big fan of the Namekian cards, and hopefully I'll get the few, few cards that I needed in this set for that playstyle. Um, and like I said, a Pycon level 5 would be really 
really cool too. Okay, so blue fire kick, black reversal strike, black back power hit, blue flying kick, black style mastery. So masteries for anyone who didn't know the game, they were key. They were they start on the field and they just give you some pretty awesome effects. And then Namekian Battle Stance Foil, which is also cool. Um, this one is usually my Sensei deck just because I why not to have more cards. Okay, so that was that. Next one, pretty cool looking Goku on the pack. Um, so I think that I had that black style mastery already. I know I somehow don't have the Namekian style mastery from the set. I don't know about, I don't think I have orange either. Okay. Stupid tricks, cool little like promo insert foil. Um, I know I've run this before, but discard non combat card in play, lower your opponent's anger one level, gain three power stages. So, pretty good all around. And the Goku level four from the set, uh, which is also rare. And I think I had that one too. Oh, wow. And it looks like how this game works the promo just doesn't count as your rare or your foil. Uh, because here is a rare foil, North Kai Sensei. So, really cool. Um, I actually don't know that I had this one. Uh, similar to Mastery, like it starts in the field, but it usually has an effect that you can't use infinitely. Um, twice per game during your non-combat step, you may choose an opponent. That opponent cannot use his Mastery for the remainder of the game, or of the turn, sorry. So, really good. Keep that with those things over there. Oh. And actually, I think this one is one that I need or don't have. Um, Oh uh, no, basically it's energy attack, it costs 4, it's always going to be, because um, it's if stopped, your opponent discards the top 4 cards of his life deck, so it's always going to be doing 4. Um, great to stop like the defense shields, if you're familiar with this game at all. Um, but yeah, back to what I was saying, so the game was popular, I think, um, we were pretty young and lived in the middle of nowhere, so that we didn't really... Um, you know, didn't really get to play with other people with that game, but it seemed to be very popular. But one thing that, um, I mean, at the beginning, the Saiyan Saga was just so confusing. And he and I bought a lot of Saiyan Saga. <laughs> Could not, like, ever. I think I had, like, one pack of Frieza. I just never saw that anywhere. And then Trunk Saga, very little. Ooh, sweet. Orange style mastery. So there's two masteries. Um, oh, and that looks cool too. I don't know that I have that card either. Um, get a better look at Red Heat Seeking Blast. Um, but yeah, so he and I, we played, but just ourselves. But yeah, the same saga. Super confusing. And then once I got to Trunks, things got better. I could, I really started buying packs, you know, besides the same saga, because they were the easiest to find. Um, Android Saga. I remember particularly buying packs, um, town over that had a Kmart. And I was all excited about that. Okay, should be... Oh, there we go, the first of the personalities. So we have Arqua, the Water Champion. 900,000 for the level 1. Physical doing plus 4 power stages of damage. If Arqua's arena is in play, raise Arqua to his highest power stage. So, cool. Cool. Oh, and a blue quick blast. Sends the deck energy attack, raising your anger 1 for each Dragon Ball your opponent controls. Put that over with the foils. Um, yeah, but back to, so like I said, I got some Andrew, Android Saga, but I didn't get the Piccolo level 1 from that at the time, um, which was like the most broken thing and defined the game for ages. Okay. 
Um, yeah, I didn't really get any amazing cards from the Android Saga back in the day. Oh, I got, I did get, let's see, I think I got eight, seven, uh, Android 17 Smirks, which is a really good card. And blue style mastery. Um, all energy attacks you perform do plus one life card damage. All blue style energy attacks you perform gain if successful Razor Anger 1. So this was the set, oh sorry, I'm getting out of focus. Um, this was the set, really cool picture, um, where they kind of reversed how things used to always work. So blue was raising your anger, red lowering your opponent's anger, orange physical, black um, energy, same and Namekian were obviously still the same. So let's get that with our masteries. Nice. Okay. Um, and then after Android Saga, of course, is the Cell Saga. And Andy and I bought a ton of Cell Saga cards. Never ever got an Ultra Rare from that. Okay. Um, but the Cell Saga was pretty cool. Um, got a Hero Starter and a Villain Starter. I did. And I got Android 20. Up oh, here's a promo. I wonder if it'll be as good a pack as the last time we got a promo. So, Heroes Gather in Mass. The next attack you perform just plus X power stages of damage. One of your... What is it? Um... One of your personalities in play gains X power stages. X equals the number of allies you have in play. Limit one per deck. Hello. With a lot of like celestial fighters. And rare Grand Kai personality here. Pretty cool. Class combat power. All of your attacks do plus one power stage of damage. Grand Kai does not have to be in control of combat to use this power. Z. Okay, we'll put him with them. Um, and a, another preview card, which is cool. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, so I bought a hero starter and a villain starter. Villain starter, I got what, in my opinion, was the worst of all of the options. I got an uh, Android 20 Dr. Zero. And I, for the hero starter, got Tickle, which I was kind of bummed about at the time. I wanted a Saiyan, but then I started to get um, Namekian. I started to get a lot of good Namekian cards, Namekian Energy Focus. Um, I think it was the first Mastery that I got, so it kind of all worked out. Oh, another personality. Torby the Silent. Level 1, 1,100,000. Energy is successful. Uh, remove the bottom card of your opponent's discard pile from the game. So. Kind of cool. Level 1. Good power. Cool artwork. And a foil. Orange Diving Attack. And Morning Back in. Evil's True Face. Another preview card. And Black Videl's Power Kick. That's weird. I don't think I had either of these two uncommon cards. So, nice. Um, but yeah. The DBZ cards. I, so I had... A lot of. I had many options that were um, for Namekians. Had quite a collection. You know, cell games, could not get the Piccolo level 5 or any Ultra Rare. And then my house went down and I lost. Oh, Arqua level 2. There we are. So we can. 1 and 2 were two thirds of the way there to being able to run that as a main personality. Um, physical doing plus four, or sorry, doing four power stages of damage. If Arqua's Arena is in play, you may use this power twice per combat. Cool, and 100,000, so it went up, uh, um, or 1 million, so it went up 100,000. Um, perfect. Um, yeah, so then, as I was saying, my house, um, there was a house fire, and I lost all my cards, which was very lame. Um, and then I ended up one time, I just decided I'm going to start buying some cards a little bit. So I bought like some Capsule Court power packs and bought a couple boxes and stuff and tried to build my collection back up. I ended up getting 
many of the same cards and honestly just building the same collection but better. Um, bought some like Namekian Strikes, so my Namekian deck was even better. Um, I think I did start out again with the starter and again got Piccolo. Ooh, here's another personality, Chai. Uh, a little bit weaker, 800,000. Physical doing four power stages of damage. If successful, prevent four power stages of damage from the next attack performed against you this combat. So, cool. And another foil. Say in sidestep. Not really a say in person, but I think Andy, he always runs saying. I think, I mean, I know he runs saying, but I think he used this card before. Can't really remember though. Um, yeah, so World Game Saga. I used to have most everything, most of the personalities, most of the masteries, most of the sensei cards. Um, I just, you know, just not the ultras. And now I have a lot of like the common stuff. Um, and I had some of the senseis, but not the masteries, not the personalities, and still no ultras. So I'm hoping to change some of that. Already with three masteries and a foil sensei, I'm happy. Okay, so here's a rare red jump kick. It's good. I have a lot of, I think I have all red master or all red rares except for this set. So I know that I'm in need of some good red cards to put in a red deck though, so this is good. Ooh, and tap car we haven't seen yet. Tap car the speedy and a foil. Pretty rad. I'll uh I'll try and come up here so you can see that how the foil is on this. So it kinda goes throughout the card too, not in the text, but behind it. Um yeah. And Tap Car is a pretty cool deck. If your opponent only had up to level 3, you pretty much won uh, most powerful personality. That was one of the ways you could win this game, like, immediately. Uh, has to do with, like, milling your own deck to raise your anger to move up a power or uh, personality level. But, this is not okay. Sand Step, Black Duck, Red, Videl's Elbow Smash. Um, but for personalities for this set, I think the only main personality I have from the starter is Pycon, actually. Um, which I have one to four and a high tech, so I just need a five. That was another thing. When I, in my old collection, I bought one starter and I was Celestial Fighters hoping to get Pycon because Pycon's really cool, in my opinion. And I did get Python. Oh, and there's Torby level 2. Did we get Torby level 1? We did. So I guess I'm going to fan these out over to the side to see what we have. So we have Arqua 1 and 2. We have Torby now 1 and 2. 1,300,000. Uh, we have Chopachai 1, and we have Tap Card 2. And I can focus blast. I like that card. Oh, I'm making tornado attack. I don't have that card. So very excited to get a new oh, sorry, I'm not used to have this. Very excited to get a new Namekian card to use. Physical attack. If you declare a Takuya Waza, this attack does six power stages of damage and raise your anger one level. Unless your main personality is Pycon, remove from the game after use. And then blue rebound. So yeah, the Namekian tornado attack, not the best, not the worst thing ever, but not the best. Um, yeah, the only ultra rares that between my cousin and I we have ever pulled um, were we split a box, a blister box, for more, um, you know, more garbage. Uh, but we split a blister box of um, the Babadi Saga. And we each got an ultra. I got the level 5, he got the level 1. He still has the 1. I traded the 5 away for a ton of awesome things. Um, and... Ooh, Arqua level 3. There we are. So we have the full line of Arqua. Fantastic. And a foil Namekian card. Always good. I mean, not necessarily good, good, but always cool. Evil's True Face again. Black that does Power Kick. And Sand Jump Shot. Um, so we had, you know, each of the two, oh, sorry, I think I said misspoke earlier. Um, the main set that had a main, or that had a starter decks, so that was every other set. Um, 
So saying not Frieza, Trunks, not Android, uh, Cell, not Cell Games, World Games, not Bobbity, Boo, and then not Fusion, not Kid Boo, because Kid Boo is just weird. But they had four Ultras, and I think the every other set that didn't have um, personalities, they only had two Ultra Rares. Um, so yeah, we have the two from that, and then he got in the Boo starter, he got the Master Roshi Sensei. So, very overdue for another ultra rare. Hint, hint. Pycon, please show up. Chop a chai, the tiny level two. So, we have that one and two. Blue Quick Blast. Cool looking card. We'll take a moment to see how cool Goku is. <laughs> okay. Um. A, we're missing some tap car, one Torby, one Chopper Also, I think there's a level four Olibu, though I don't have levels one and two of that dude. So, or right, one, two, and three. Sorry. Alright, West Kai Sensei. I know I have this dude already. Uh, but, you know, having more is, is cool. Because it's a cool guy. Uh, once per game, during your attacker's attack phase, you may remove up to two non combat cards in play from the game. Really good. Um, just getting rid of things that can be a huge threat. Then I can focus blast, then I can tornado attack again. Three rebound and a Mechian combo. Lots of Mechian cards in this set. Um, which, even though Pycon is not technically a Mechian, he can um, in this game use Mechian style attacks, declare a Mechian to clear with that. The only thing he cannot do is use Mechian heritage only. But most of the really good Mechian cards are not Mechian heritage only. Oh, from the promos set. King Cold, the Boastful, level 2. Um, I think I do have this guy. It's kind of from like the Underworld, the like first episode of the filler of Pycon's arc. But I think I already have this guy, but it's cool. And Chopper Chai, level 3, so we have that full set, too. Um, don't want to say things to jinx us, but thanks. So. And a foil, well, that kind of counters what I was just about to say, I didn't want to say. Um, the fact that we hadn't really had any repeats yet. So chapter level 2 is a repeat, but it's foil, and that's cool. Because, you know, you don't have to get foiled, but when you get a foil, even if it's a repeat, it's a foil. So, we have the full Chopper Chai line, we have the full Aqua line. Uh, we need a Torby level 3, and Top Car 1 and 3, and a Pycon level 5. <laughs> Majin Display of Power. Orange friendship. After the battle, Goku picks. I think yeah, Goku picked Pycon up there. Yeah, I was gonna say maybe that was a Libu, but no, they um because Pycon wasn't on the ground ever. Then. So yeah. Um, also, what did you think of the that filler arc? If you are a fan of Dragon Ball Z, I know I haven't really done much Dragon Ball Z on my channel, so. You may not be a fan of it, but probably because everyone seems to be a fan of Dragon Ball Z. Okay. Oh, I didn't even know this existed in the set. So there's a Krillin level 3, Krillin the Great. Um, weaker than every personality we have pulled so far, except for Tapcar. <laughs> um, but Krillins always have cool effects. Andy usually would use Krillin, not me. But hey, it's cool if I get all of them. I could like, use it surprisingly, except not surprisingly because I'll probably watch this. But I could use it, because why not? Okay. And last one from this half of the box is another one with cool Goku art. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I, I really like PyCon. Um, I like the filler arc. It was a little extra comedy that... Um, 
the series tends not to have much of. Okay, well, I'm going to turn the bus through here pretty quick. Because, oh, Supreme Kai Level 1 Preview. Uh, I always like that. I was, was always bummed, though, that they didn't, I don't think, to my knowledge, make a... They didn't make a level 3. I think they just have level 1 and 2, which I have already level 2. I did not have 1. So excited about that. And foil, Red Kid Trunks thing. Yaking Tornado Attack. Jackie Chan's Energy Attack. And Saiyan Dead Attack. Okay, so that's the first half of the box. You can see I already pulled all these cards in just the commons a lot. I can hardly fit the whole stack in my hand. And then some of the cool cards that we got. I guess it's so. Sorry, I'm getting very confused with which direction this is going because it's upside down on my screen. But yeah, so here are some cool cards. So West Kai Sensei, Blue Style Mastery, Orange Style Mastery, Black Style Mastery. Other rare cards, the Capsule Corp and Red Jump Kit. Okay, uh, then Supreme Kai level 1, Grand Kai, Pycon level 4, cool, and the same power level as Goku level 4, who is also cool, but not as cool as Pycon, in this sub arc. Later, Goku is probably cooler, but. Um, and then some more personalities, the small one, so Torby 1 and 2, so we're hoping to get a 3. Sorry, I keep missing where this camera is exactly. There we go. Chopper Chai, one, two, uh, foil and non foil, and then three. So, cool for that. Aqua, one, two, and three. And finally, the end of personalities for the first half um, King Cold level two, who is super foil. Tap card the speedy level 2, which is very cool, and then Quillen level 3. So, there are those things. Uh, give me a second, I'm going to pause things, and then we will come back to do the other half. If I can get my focus. That's, I think I'll it. Yep. Alright, so we'll be right back. Alright, so I'm back. I got up, got myself some more coffee, and I tried to adjust the camera a little bit. Sorry, that is said coffee. Um, so we're going to see if this works better or worse. I want to just try and eliminate some of the glare. Um, okay, let's see. This is, I'll try to keep this spot here. So, I'm very happy so far with everything we've got. Um, obviously the second half, you get less happy because you tend to get more doubles since you just opened half a box. Uh, but, you know, I'm really only looking at, like, looking for rares and hollows and ultras, so. I'm happy. Hey, I'm opening Dragon Ball Z cards again. I'm happy anyways. So, North Kai Sensei, speaking of repeats. Oh, I didn't show that off last time, but I did get the foil version. Sorry, it was in a different place than the rest of the Senseis. Blue Lightning Block. Goku's Quickness Drill, not as good as Vegeta's Quickness Drill. Red Lightning Strike. And then enjoy. This over. Next one. Okay, I'll try and speed through this. We'll go through the puppet level one. These were some weird cards that existed based on the news report of um the cell games, which is why it has the cell games thing here. It's part of the promo to go with like stupid tricks. Um, I've never had this card actually, so I'm kind of cool. Even though I'm not a Goku fan, but physical doing plus five or plus four is successful. And the sorry, everything's upside down for me. In the bottom card of your discard pile is a Goku named card. You may draw that card into your hand. So that's really good if you run a lot of named Goku cards. Tap card level 1, which we don't have yet also, so awesome. And Torby level 1, who we do have, but this one's foil. And 
I remember I used to have a Torby foil in my old collection, level 3. I had 1 through 3. And I had the foil level 3, which was one of my faves, because it looks cool foil, and Torby's cool, and yeah, so awesome. So I'm putting that cool pile. And awesome, so fantastic pack there. <laughs> um, sorry, let's finish on that. Black Mountain Blast, and I can I beam. I don't I think I have that. I don't think I have enough of them to if I wanted to run. Um, in this game you can run I believe it's four. Yeah, you can run four of most cards. I think. I think. I don't remember. It's been so long since I've played or built a deck, but I will be soon. Grand Kai Sensei. This is one I have never had, actually. So, one reason I've never had it. One. Sensei decks, it's kind of like an extra deck in Dragon Ball Z. Um, all right, well, it's I guess it's more like a side deck. Um, you can put this many cards under it, and then at the start of the match, after you reveal your personality, um, and your opponent reveals theirs, and I, and I think you have to reveal their mastery, too. I don't really remember. Um, then you get to swap those out in your deck, but you don't get to choose what you swap it out with. So if I do one, just after I shuffled my opponent cut, top card of your deck goes under there for whatever card you're putting in. So it's risky, but it can give huge advantage because there are cards that can be in the Sensei deck that are like, if your opponent, if you declare Tukuyo Waza and your opponent declared a Saiyan Tukuyo Waza, and you'll know that, so you can get like huge effects. But this one is once per combat, not once per game. You may prevent two power stages of damage from an attack, so pretty terrible. But it's cool, and it's foil, and I didn't have it, so I'm happy. Gohan, level 4. I've also not had that. I didn't know he was in this set. Um, I mean, I recognize the card, but yeah, it's it's pretty pretty awesome. Um, then it's Gohan, and Gohan's cool. Crown the Father, level 1. Um, this is one I think I have? No, actually, I know. I didn't have this. I didn't have any of the Krillin cards from this set. I used to have, but... Alright, so we have one and three from this, so good. We're two-thirds of the way there for his set. Thank you, Mayor Maya. Black, Black King. Red Solar Flare. Come on, cool Goku Art Pack. Get us Pycon Level 5. Or Goku's Blinding Strike, although if I did get that would be controversial because my cousin is the master of Goku cards and it is a Goku named card even though it is used in all extra decks and particularly in Namekians because they tend to be energies so Fro oh we haven't even seen any of this Frog I forgot he existed too so Frog the Huge level 3 2 million, so powerful. So, got some more personalities to draw. Orange Power Kick, Namekian Final Flash, Namekian Defense, Saiyan Uppercut. Okay. Glare is not any better. Top card level. <laughs> Sorry, excuse me. Top card level two. This is repeat. All of the other level two top card we had was a foil, so it's not exactly a repeat, but it's a repeat. Okay. Um. So yeah, how are you guys all doing? <laughs> um, I appreciate you sticking with us if you're enjoying this. That's, that's cool. Because I'm enjoying doing this and I figured I would just, uh, just do it on camera because I like watching some unboxings. So I figured this is one that, because like, I'm not going to do an unboxing like Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh! because everyone's, everyone does those, everyone sees those, people will do those better than me. But this is something unique that I don't think a lot of people do since the game is very old. Ooh, here's one I don't have and I don't think I've ever had. 
Iskai Sensei. Once per game, during any non-combat step, raise your main personality to its highest power stage. So, not as good as West or North Kai, or South Kai, but could be okay, I think. But still, now I have all of them, because I already had South, which you didn't get this time, but, I mean, I've had in the past. Okay. So, very happy, all the senseis. Um, haven't got any masteries yet in this half of the box. Um, and still no ultra rare, but it's coming. It's coming soon. Don't worry. I'm worrying. Okay. Freeze of the Untouchable, level 1. Um, I believe I had this one already in my collection, but it's still, it's Frieza, it's promo, it's foil, it's cool, so. It goes over with that King Cold. Uh, the World Tournament, nope, this was not the rare that I had before, this is Capsule Corp with that, so. World Tournament, I guess I can turn it this way for you. You know, I think it, who's a cool looking pack design for this stuff because they didn't have any with pack on. Um, if they did, that's really embarrassing that I've opened this many and didn't notice it, but I don't think they have any that have on this artwork. Um, but yeah, so I'm thinking that's going to be the Goku pack that will have an ultra rare. Majin Spokovich level 1. Jeez, there were so many rare personalities in this set. Um, so, that's another one that we don't have the full set to. Ooh, Aaron the Foil, Namekian card, which we know I like. Uh, this I remember is not a good card at all, Namekian Offense, but I don't think I had many of them, so still cool. Maybe I could figure out a way to use it. There we are, Red Style Mastery with Goku Kyo Kaio Kenning. Um, I don't think that this is particularly good. I think the other Red Style Masters I have are better, but it's always nice to have extra options. And oh, sorry, I need to readjust my position here. Um, yeah, always nice to have extra options, and so this is an extra option, and it's really cool. And that's also really cool looking. <laughs> Um, so, the only, ugh, sorry, alright, so the only masteries that I didn't get yet this time around are Saiyan and Mechan. I think I have Saiyan, I do not have the Mechan mastery somehow from this set, so. Oh, and I forgot that this existed. Freestyle Mastery. This was the first set that offered that, but Freestyle Mastery is if you do not use any styled cards as they put them. And cool artwork. There we go, we focus. Yeah, so cool artwork with Gohan, Goten, Trunks, Vegeta, and Piccolo. Um, yeah, I don't know how good this card is. I've never used Freestyle before, but I might start. And a foil card too. No, no, not an exciting one, but a foil nonetheless. Sorry, just have to move some things because it's so many cards. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine packs left, if I can count. And another Goku one. Another one of those promos, rats foiled again. Villains only, I'm usually a villain. Uh, discard an ally in play. Non-combat cards may not be used for the remainder of combat, limit one per deck. Um, not bad, but 
my opponent doesn't use, my general opponent, Andy, does not use um, promo card, or uh, ally cards very often, so. Oh, and uh, there's another um, rare personality that we do not yet have, Majin Spopovich, level 2. We have the level 1. So, we're partway there. Two thirds of the way there, as we kept saying. Oh, and perfect! Krillin foil level 2, which was the level we didn't have for Krillin. So we have that full set in this, um, in this, whatever this is called, <laughs> saga, pack, set, whatever. So we have Krillin 1 to 3 now. I'm very, very happy with the variety of pulls that we've had. Um, it's been pretty, pretty awesome. I was not the not the common cards, but the rares have had good variety. Oh, uh, there we are. Speaking of variety, there we are. Saiyan style mastery. So that means the only master I don't have yet from this set somehow is the Namekian style. <laughs> So if we could get that, that'd be really cool to have pulled the full seven masteries in the box. Um, but honestly, I have so many. I have all the other Mecha masteries, and this one is not my favorite. I actually think I had it at one point, maybe. Maybe not, but I mean, I used to in my old collection, I know. But I know that um, Andy has it, so... I could get it if I really wanted it. Oh, Frog level one, which was one we have not yet had. We have one and three, so that puts us on our way. And a foil, cool looking card with Goku charging up Kamehameha right in Pycon's face. Remember with the foils and the truck. Not as good as the car. If you're familiar with the game at all, you know the car. Every every Android 17 and Android 18 card from the, the uh, from the Cell Saga, they all had effects that had to do with if the car was in play or getting the car in play. And then they would do like extra things. Which is really weird because it's not like it was that huge a thing. Majin Spopovich level 3? That's Oh perfect, that's the one we need to complete that set too. So we have them all. Wow, I am so impressed that we didn't get, like, 17 copies of Frobe Level 1 and no other copies of any other personalities. I'm thrilled with this. The only thing that can make it better, well, two things that can make it better. The Namekian Mastery, just to complete that full set, and pack on Level 5, or any Ultra Rare. But pack on level five. Oh my god! And it was upside down for some reason. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm so excited, oh my god! Pack on the prize fighter, level five. Focus energy attack. Doing one life card damage. If successful, remove the bottom five cards of your opponent's life deck from the game and look really freaking cool. I'm oh, sorry, I'm out of... Oh my god! And you can sell this on eBay for like a hundred bucks or more, which would cover the entire cost of the box, but not for me because I got level 5! Yay! Uh, and then... Oh, because that was upside down, so back to this. I mean, obviously everything's gonna be Less cool from there. Oh my god, I got level five. Um, so foil card. Okay, well time to bust through these other packs, but uh, pack on level five, pack on level five, I have pack on level five. Okay, so let's see what else we can get now that all the pressure's out of the way, because the box was absolutely, even before getting packed on level 5, it was worth it, but... Seth kind of sensei, which we didn't get in this pack. I already had it, but we didn't get it, and now we can get it. So I think I got all of the sensors too. Let me see, I have East, West, 
South, North was foil, Grand Kai, yeah. So I got all of them from this set. So that's cool. So we have three packs left, one of each. Um, let's see. We need to finish off the Frogue set with level two. Um, we need. I think that's the only set that we have started for personalities that we have not completed. <laughs> that is crazy. For, oh my god! <laughs> I could not make this any better at all. Frog level 2. And a foil card. But Frog level 2, so Frog is complete. Chopachai is complete. Arqua is complete. Spopovich is complete. Krillin is complete. Torby is complete. Tapcar. Tapcar is not complete. We do need a level 3 Tapcar. I may have that already, but. Okay. So, tap. We need a. If one of these can have Namekian Style Mastery, and one of these can have a Tapcar level 3, it will be a perfect box. But it's still the best box. Capsule core and a foil straining. Or good, no, not straining. Go tanks focus blast. Okay, and finally the last pack, a Goku pack. You know Goku was destined for great things, so we'll see what the final Goku pack reveals. And the Mackin style mastery. Oh my gosh, this is too cool. Uh, wow, wow. I can't even imagine this, the nonsense of this. Okay, so just to recap here for you we have Namekian mastery, Zane mastery, Red mastery, Blue mastery. Oh, I fell on my hand. Orange mastery. Black Mastery, and Freestyle Mastery, all seven of them. For Senseis, we have Grand Kai Sensei, North Kai Sensei, those are both foil, South Kai Sensei, East Kai Sensei, and West Kai Sensei. So all of those. The level four personalities that were based on main personalities from the set, Gohan level four, Pycon level 4, Goku level 4, the only one we didn't get then was Olibu, I believe, was the only one. Grand Kai level 1, Supreme Kai level 1, Krillin 1, 2, and 3, yes we're doing this on my bed, that's why I can change the glare by pushing down on the mattress. But one, two, and three. Two's the foil one, which I've never had that one before. Full set of Frog, one, two, and three. Chop a chai, one, two, and three. And two of foil and non foil. Arqua, 1, 2, and 3. Spopovich, 1, 2, and 3. With incredibly low power levels. <laughs> and the three promo things I got. King Cold, Goku the Puppet, and Frieza. Uh, oh, here, I skipped him. Tapcar, just one and two, um, and two are at foil or non-foil. I'll have to check my collection to see if I already had three, but not a huge deal that I don't. Um, 
bunch of other random cards, and of course, PyCon level 5, PyCon level 5, looking super rad, it's hard for Goku for the strongest power level until the next set, <laughs> ah, so freaking excited, this was the one I wanted more than anything, and I got it, um, and then also, Well, I can't even fit when I zoom in the camera. But, uh, <laughs> all those common and uncommon cards also. Um, yeah, so we're just gonna set this here while I chat at you a little bit. But yeah, so um, let me know down below. You know, leave a like if you're excited for the, if you enjoyed it, or if just you're excited for me for getting pack on level five, pack on level five. Um, but yeah, leave a like, comment, subscribe, let me know if you enjoyed this, because it's very different than anything I've done before. Um, I don't have any other Dragon Ball Z boxes coming anytime soon, um, at least not planned yet, but I do have a box of, I pre-ordered a box of the new Yu-Gi-Oh set, because um, that's a lot of Dark Magician stuff and nostalgia, so I wanted to get it. And um, yeah, so let me know if you want to see me unbox that. Like I said, my my mindset in unboxing this, even in the first place, was because it was, I thought, unique in that it's the old score game and they're, you know, they haven't made these, anything um, in so long, so it's really not, uh, not, not relevant because it, like, there is the new game that it can kind of, like, be used with, but, you know, no one's, buy new things, really. I had to find this on eBay. Um, so I thought it'd just be something interesting that, like, other people couldn't, you know, tons of other people don't do. Um, but, I don't know um, but yeah, so let me know if you enjoyed this. If you want to see more, I could do the Yu-Gi-Oh! one when that comes in in a couple weeks. Um, and I could just keep this on my radar so that if I buy, like, another box, um, you know, now I need to buy a Cell Games box because I need to pick a little five to go pack on that five. Um, but yeah, so thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, um, or if you didn't enjoy it but you just watched it the whole way, then you are even cooler. Uh, no, you're not cooler because you didn't enjoy it, but you are also cool still for at least watching it all. Um, and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye.